Hi everyone, it's Christy. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a fabulous day so far. Today's video is a new handbag video. Um, I mentioned in a video or two ago that I had ordered a new bag and yes, it did come in and I'm very excited to show it to you today. Um, it's not a high-end designer bag. It is a um, probably from a brand you've never even heard of. Um, but anyway, I hope after this video you go check them out and see if it might be for you. Anyway, before I do that though, I want to say thank you to everyone who watched my last video. It was kind of my new boyfriend vacation drama <laughs> video and um, everyone who watched it and gave me comments and um, advice, I just want to thank you so much. I read through all of it. Um, it was all very helpful and um, I am proceeding uh, with an open mind and a little bit of caution and I may do an update on that at some point, but right now I'm just um, trying to be there for him and be supportive. And um, anyway, we'll we'll talk more about that later. This is a bag video. <laughs> so anyway, um, let's go back to the bag. Um, I did first hear this brand from watching YouTube videos, of course. Um, there are a few uh, videos from this brand, but the video that I was watching was one from uh, Marnie Goldberg. If you've never seen her videos, she's does amazing videos and um, she was showing a really really cool structured bag from this this brand um, I went on the website checked them out and the, that bag specifically was a little smaller than what I was kind of hoping for um, but I did go through all the different bags that they have and checked out their sales section and decided to try one of the bags that were on sale and see how much I liked you know the brand and I have to say that I'm very impressed with their quality and their craftsmanship and their leather is amazing. So anyway, um, let me show you the bag that I got. Um, this bag is called the Tory Tote. Now, um, I, that's what I needed in, in my collection. I needed a big tote. Um, I've looked at the Louis Vuitton Neverfull so many times, but the only thing keeping me from getting that bag is that it seems like Every other mom in Southern California has one. I know that's that's not the re really good reason not to get a bag, but for me, I don't like to carry bags that every seems like everyone's carrying. And I'm not lying. If you went to a soccer game, half the moms are carrying Neverfulls. And I don't know. I just like to be unique, I guess. So anyway, I went with this tote again. This is the Tory tote. It is very similar to the Neverfull. Um, in size and in, you know, it's just a basic tote. Um, the leather on this is absolutely fabulous. It's this beautiful pebbly leather. Um, it smells amazing. Um, the structure of the bag, the stitching, everything is just really high quality. You've got these um, gold tone rivets here that kind of keep the strap on. They do say GG New York, very small. Um, you'll notice the initials here, these are my initials. Um, yes, you can get pretty much everything that they sell personalized with initials, um, up to three initials. And being that I don't have anything with my initials on it, I thought I would go ahead and do that. Um, this is the, the wine color. It's actually more of a, an eggplant. You can kind of see that it is definitely a purple, a dark purpley plum. It's a gorgeous color. Um, the other colors that are in their winter sale are um, dark hunter green, I think they call it pine, and a beautiful cobalt blue. I, I may even decide to go back and get another tote in blue. But let's talk about this tote specifically. It is, according to their website, 18 and a half inches across. Um, and that's from this measurement on top, and it does kind of flare out a little bit. So the measurement from what you can actually fit inside is about 15 inches. Um, on their website, it says that the bag is 15 and a half inches high. When I measured that, though, that measurement is from this bottom seam. Um, actual height is more of like about 12 inches, and it is 7 inches across on the bottom. Um, like I said, it's kind of in between that Louis Vuitton M, Neverfull MM and the GM. It's a little bit bigger than the MM and not quite as big as the GM. But this is what it looks like on me. It's a nice size tote. It's perfect for work for travel, for shopping, just anything where you need that big tote. Absolutely love this. Yes, my dog is back there on the bed again. Some of you who comment about my dog, um, he just refuses to be outside the room when I film, so I let him lay on, the, on my bed. 
So he, he's actually 12 years old and he, most of the time he acts like a puppy, but when I'm filming, he looks like he's, you know, just a half a step away from kicking the bucket. But that's my buddy, that's Reef. So anyway, back to the bag again. Um, so yeah, I am just really impressed with this, with the, the, this bag, with this leather. I'll show you the inside and I'll take out the stuffing. It is, you know, ginormous on the inside. Um, on this side, you do have, um, it does have a, a magnetic closure. You do have a pocket here and you do have that GG New York um, stamp there. It's a nice size pocket. It keeps my cell phone and everything. Um, you'll notice that the inside is not lined. It is th the gorgeous, softest suede. It's actually just the back side of the leather but it's so soft, it's luxurious. It just feels amazing. The only thing is that, um, being that this leather is so soft, you do get a little bit of sag um, when you put stuff in here. So I may invest in a little base shaper for this. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to add this to my collection. It's something I didn't have, and I'm very impressed with their leather um, and the, the craftsmanship on these. Um, I did a little research, and I, there are a couple other videos from GG New York. Um, and one of them kind of gives a, a factory tour, so I will link that video that I found below. Um, tell you more about the company itself. These bags are all handmade in New York and Long Island somewhere, so happy to support an American company. And um, I'm really interested in some of the other bags. Um, I, like I said, and maybe I haven't said it, um, I just got an email yesterday and um, all of their winter sale bags are now 50% off. Um, the regular price for this bag is $350, which is a good price for an all leather tote. Um, but I got mine because it was 40% off for $210, and now this is down to about $175, I think. So, gosh, what an amazing price for an all leather tote like this. You just can't beat it. So, yes, go check out GG New York. If you're looking for a big tote, this Tory tote is fabulous. They also have a tote that has, it's a little smaller than this, but it has a zipper if you like, if you're really needing a zipper. Um, they have another tote that has kind of that inside pocket um, and then two sides. They've got some fabulous satchels, a gorgeous, really cool um, bucket bag, some really cute crossbody bags. They just have a lot of really nice styles. So, yes, do go check them out. Um, also, what I want to show you is a couple smaller accessories that I got. Um, I got um, the, one of them that was on sale and one of them that wasn't. Um, also in this beautiful wine eggplant color, I got this cool um, cell phone case. It's an all leather cell phone case. Um, it is made for the iPhone 6 and yes, I did get this one hot stamped with my initials as well. Um, it's got a magnetic closure here and inside you've got, oh, do I have anything that's showing really? I guess not. <laughs> um, you've got three pockets here um, that do hold quite a few different cards. Um, you've got a pocket back here um, that holds plenty of cash, whatever. It's a great handy thing just, you know, if you're running into the store, you just grab this so you don't need everything else. And then on this side you've got the, um, the cell phone part. And you're, you may notice that there's no hole here for the camera, and that's because this just pops off. Um, it's kind of a Velcro backing, although neither one side is fuzzy. Um, they do just put together and snap in there very securely. Um, I like that because um, most of the cases that I've seen that have the hole here for the camera, you can kind of see the outline when you're taking photos or videos. So I kind of like that I could just snap this off or throw my phone in a smaller bag if I don't want to use this. But again, very nice cell phone case. This retails for the normal price is $125, and um, this was, I got this for $75, and now it's even less than that, $60 something. So, a really good buy. And again, these come in different colors, um, lots of different colors, and some, the ones that are on sale um, are the dark green, um, the cobalt blue, and the wine, and maybe a couple other colors. The last thing I got is this cute um, little new. Um, envelope style business card holder. Um, I did get this one hot stamped as well. Just look at the leather on this. It is really cool. It's kind of this pebbly, almost um, stingray looking, but it's not stingray. But anyway, it opens here. Um, it holds about 20 business cards. 
I've been using this little metal one that I got years ago for a long time, and I just wanted something that's very small, easy to throw in whatever bag I'm taking so I have business cards on hand, and I think it's just very classy looking. Um, you could also use this as a small wallet. Definitely throw you know, a credit card, debit card, some cash in there, and use this as a small wallet in your other bags, but I'm gonna use mine for my business cards. So anyway, like I said, they are having a big sale right now. Um, I think this is the last week for it, so check them out. And um, yeah, I'm really happy with this brand. I'm glad I found it, and I will definitely show you the new bag that I just ordered when it comes in. Very excited for it. It's more of a work, um, structured work bag. So anyway, I have to go to work um, right now anyway, but I will um, be back soon, and I hope you all have a fabulous day. All right, everybody. Bye-bye.